So let's go for question number four again. So on dividing this polynomial by a polynomial gx, the question and remainder obtained are this and this respectively. Find gx. Okay. What are we doing here exactly? We are dividing. We are dividing this particular polynomial, right? Okay. So, <clears throat> we are dividing this particular polynomial. So, this polynomial, <coughs> this polynomial will be called as dividing. Okay. We are dividing this polynomial. So, this particular polynomial will be called as dividing. So, your dividend will be x cubed minus 3x square plus x plus 1. Alright? So we are going to divide this polynomial, which is your dividend, by another polynomial, gx. Oh, so we are going to divide this polynomial by gx. gx is going to divide this. So gx will be called as divisor. So your divisor your divisor will be gx. Now, the quotient and the remainder obtained here, x minus 2n minus 2x plus 4. That means your quotient obtained is x minus 2 and the remainder obtained is minus 2x plus. Okay? So what we do here is, in order to find out gx, we have to apply the division algorithm so by division algorithm algorithm we know that dividend is equal to divisor into quotient plus remainder your dividend is x cubed minus 3x squared plus x plus 2 your divisor is gx times your quotient x minus 2 plus your remainder. Your remainder is minus 2x plus 4 plus minus 3 is your minus, right? Now we solve this. x cubed minus 3x squared plus x plus 2. Now this minus 2x can be transposed to the left side as minus plus 2x. Plus 4, you transpose it as minus 4. So we get here gx times x minus 2. Alright? Now, x cubed minus 3x squared. x plus 2x. x plus 2x gives you yes. 2 minus 4 gives you minus 2. Is equal to gx times x minus 2. Now, in order to obtain gx, I need to transpose this term to the other side. Okay. So, x cubed minus 3x squared plus 3x minus 2 has to be divided by x minus 2. Then you can obtain gx. Okay. So, let us perform the division. x cubed minus 3x squared plus 3x minus 2 plus 3x minus 2 has to be divided by x minus 2 I is it correct? okay yes so let's perform the division the only rule is that make the first term equal x into x square gives you x cubed as it is positive you make it negative you cancel it out Minus 2 times x squared is minus 2x squared. We change the order of the sign for the second term, for the lower term. Minus 3 plus 2 gives you minus 1x squared, or simply minus x squared, <coughs> plus 3x minus 2. Now again, <coughs> x into minus x, minus x squared. <coughs> we change the order of the sign, then we can cancel out. Minus into minus plus, 2 times x is, yes, make it negative. 
3 minus 2, 1x, <coughs> or simply x, and then we have minus 2. <coughs> now, x times 1 is x, and the <coughs> minus 2 plus 1, minus, plus, minus, <coughs> 2 into 1 is 2. Is it okay? So the gx obtained is your x squared minus x plus 1, which is the required solution. Okay? Now we'll go for the next one, question number 6.